<laughs> I'd listen to that band. Yeah, it's called Sploosh. Welcome to Sploosh. <laughs> oh man, the 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 tweet this week I was pretty happy with. Hold on, let me dig this up. It's a good mix of whose line is it anyway, and Frank Reynolds. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect timing for Sploosh. <laughs> What was really funny was uh, the fucking um, the bands that like had one song that they were known for, and they would like refuse to bust it out until the very end. Yeah. Oh no, they want they want you to stick around to the end. <laughs> mm. And that that's the that's the pro move at a concert. If you know they only have one good song, you can pretty well guarantee they're gonna play it at the end. Andy Dufresne. That was the last time, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you, after he met them rapist boys, his thoughts were extra watery. <laughs> I don't know what a hollow back girl is. All I know is it sounds <laughs> like a nasty. <laughs> Just, he gets into it so hard. Oh, gross. <laughs> Alright, do we have any good jokes for the pre-show, or... Oh, wait. Absolutely not. Oh, yeah, we. this will be a pre-show. I'll have to chop out the beginning <coughs> to make it for the podcast. This won't make it, is what I'm saying. This is only for people who watch it on Twitch. Okay, in that way, so I, I have some grievances against Croatian people. Ooh... <laughs> well, Grim will be listening, so he's probably in the same Perfect. boat. <laughs> He'll be like, well, all Croatian people are inbred. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. He's been calling us inbred for a long time. <laughs> he ain't wrong. Well, you know, I'll have to come back to you next week with more info. Speaking of next week, here's something. Here's something we can talk about. I've really been uh, looking at like other people we can bring into the show. Uh-huh. And uh, I, I spoke with Drake, and he's said that he's down with jumping on the show, you know, maybe a couple times a month, like maybe twice a month. Nice. Um, and uh, Purple Drank. Purple Drank. That's what and, I'm calling him. And, and I'm, gonna, I'm going to be reaching out to a few other people, uh, you know, about seeing if they can fill it, and maybe we can get, like, a... Like, not a solid third, but a rotating third yeah. person on the show. Yeah. And if we like it, you know, maybe make it permanent. Um, For sure. But, yeah, I guess that's a little, a little, little bit of housekeeping. A little update. Oh. oh, shit, it's upgrade. Oh, shit, it's upgrade. Right. Uh, the, the like last time she says that she's just totally resigned. She's not like scared. She's not in hiding or anything. She's just like right. Oh shit, it's up right. Oh shit, it's up right. Like it is. I mean, she's yeah. not, she's she's definitely not wrong. Not at all. It is upgrade. Definitely. You know. Let's see if I can upgrade oh, shit, how upgrade. loud the output is from your. Uh... <laughs> 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 Trying to upgrade how loud your ass is right now. Okay, hold on. I can I can move it up a little. <clears throat> no, I got I got user volume over here. Okay. I'm watching the volumes, and yours are really low. <clears throat> I would like all the fans to know that I did shirt myself again. Hmm. Oh, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, it's, it's still, hey, gamers. <clears throat> it's still really low, even though I have this thing maxed out. <laughs> uh, let me see what I can do about that. How's that?
No. It's still it's still hanging around pretty low. Usually it uh, on on the bar it goes from uh here. It starts at the top at zero and goes mm. down into negatives basically. Mm -hmm. So there's negative five, ten, fifteen, twenty, all the way down to sixty. And we start at the bottom, so it starts at negative sixty and it jumps up. Now we're here. And yeah. mine jumps up. I have mine down a little bit to try to match yours, and mine hangs out between twenty-five and thirty-five. And yours is down mm -hmm. well lower, hanging out around forty-five to fifty-five. Oh, that's weird. So I, I have a my my input volume all the way up on my device, and it's all the way up on your device. So yeah, it's pretty weird. Hopefully, it, hopefully it works out. Hopefully, I can kind of match. Okay. Match our volumes, basically. All right. All right, good to start. You want to start at 1430? Uh, yeah. All right. And I figure starting it like normal, just so I have a spot that I can cut into. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, so you know where. Yeah, when I'm editing. Which I'll be able to edit it um, not right after the show, but it'll be later tonight. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I won't. I mean, I won't uh, get to it until tomorrow morning, so. Okay, cool. It'll go up just a hair late, but I'm like, that's where you go. Especially after missing a week. Welcome to the Mammoth Games cast for the week of July 15th. I am one of your hosts, Night Swarm, and with me, as always, Filtercord. How's it going? It's going, man. Uh, how's it going with you? I know uh, currently, right now, you're on the road. You're <laughs> shooting this from, like, a hotel. Uh, yeah, I am reporting live-ish uh, from uh, Incarceration. Yes. At... Uh, the old Ohio State uh, reformatory in uh, Mansfield. Ugh. Let me say, is... I would not build things out here if it was up to me. I, I agree, but that place that the <laughs> concert's at is uh, yeah. really fucking cool. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's Shawshank right. Prison from Shawshank Redemption. Um, they also filmed like parts of, I guess, Air Force One here or something. So, they've done several. There's been multiple recordings of different stuff. So how is how is the setting uh, for the concert? Is it is it very much you yeah, really understand cool. that you're at a concert, or is it kind of creepy as well? Oh no, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's out on the grounds. Um, oh, you know, it's, it's kind of like okay. a it's like a Romanesque revival building, I guess. Um, so they have like two stages outside of it. Mm -hmm. One is kind of in between the main building and one of the cell blocks, and the other is just out in the front because it's so big that they needed extra space. Um, but yeah, inside, I mean, a big thing that they do, it's like a uh, sort of like, um, I've been trying to think of how to describe the music. It's like sort of alt rock and hard rock, um, butt rock. But then also inside the prison, uh, in like the old guards quarters area. So they you can do like a self-guided tour at any time. It's just included in the ticket price. So they just have the building open, which is oh, really cool. Yeah. And then um, they're also doing like uh, a, a big like tattoo festival inside at the same time. Yeah. Which is really cool. So just like walking around and seeing like people came here from like Portland, Oregon, uh, Florida. Um, there's a guy from Texas. Like people came from all over. This is big, really big business for tattoo artists. Nice. So, oh, yeah. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. There's like a very large like biker crowd. There's a lot of over forties, which is kind of surprising. Well, well yeah, th that's actually surprising. a big thing in the area. Is like mm -hmm. some pretty big biker older groups. folks. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Um, um, I, I know one of my friends. He went to he went to a show there, but I, I don't. I think I think the show was in a building. Yeah, this is only the second year they've done it. I think before they did it inside somewhere. Yeah. Um, but, he, I mean, it, because in he, he the was, first year, they way oversold. Yeah, I mean, this was, it was, 
It would have been a pretty long time ago. It probably would have been. Okay, so it was probably just a different concert. Like 2006, maybe 2005. <coughs> so it, it's it's been quite a long time. Wow. But he's like, yeah, yeah, fuck that. <laughs> he, he's like, <laughs> he's like, it, it was it was a good show, but. He uh, yeah. he broke off. The place to go was to, creepy. He broke off to go to the bathroom, and it was already like completely like nighttime at this point. And he broke off mm-hmm. to go to the bathroom. He's like, next time I'd rather just shit my pants. <laughs> I mean, you're I, going I'm, to either way. So. I'm good. <laughs> Might as well do it at the show, right? Yeah, I mean the the prison itself. They do like um, haunted tours and stuff. I mean, yeah. you know, it's I mean, not it's, like the most like fucking spooky place on earth or anything but sure. it's definitely got some some weird like it's one of those things where like if you know the story that makes it a lot worse like yeah you know obviously we're not going to like debate the existence of ghosts or whatever but like uh, when you're like oh in real life in this cell this dude burned himself alive in the 60s and it's yeah. like mm-hmm. uh yeah that's that's kind of dark when you start thinking about that and you walk by and you hear like a fucking moth like flutter its asshole inside and you're like, oh, that was the fire. <laughs> like you hear like a squeaky yeah, fart. What was that? <laughs> that was my last fart. <laughs> so yeah. I mean, so, just um, in, yeah. Overall, inside, really cool. There's some there's some good shows going on. Inside, bring you know, if you're going inside, just do yourself the flavor and bring yourself the extra underwear. Mm-hmm. Plastic bag. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you want the and underwear in a plastic bag. I thought that went without saying. I would say I probably Ziploc, uh-huh. the one with the the freshness seal, because there's Absolutely. gonna Absolutely you are gonna yeah. get shit on that bag. <laughs> you don't want you don't want the one where you have to push it to get it to stick. You want the you want the little zippy that goes across. 